Dozen of Russian tanks destroyed by UK weapons. Russian tanks have been destroyed by weapons provided by the UK, it has been confirmed. Speaking in the UK capital, Ukraine's ambassador to London Vadim Prostako said the anti-tank weaponry provided by the UK known as NLAW, Next Generation Light Anti-Armor Weapon, had been used to help the state defend itself against Russian forces. However, he said people are dying as we speak in the pushback against Russia, and Ukraine needed something which only NATO can provide. At this moment, we have enough people, we don't have enough equipment, he said. We should have started to prepare much earlier, maybe decades ago. That's why we've been trying to get into NATO for all these years because we always believed this would come. Defense Minister James Heapy told MPs that the government would explore options to support the Ukrainians themselves over the next few days, but added NATO troops should not play an active role in the country because of the risk of miscalculation leading to existential threat. Mr. Heapy added that 1,000 UK troops are on standby to support Hungary, Slovakia, Romania and Poland with the expected humanitarian challenges that they will face as people make their way out of Ukraine. He explained that troops could not realistically be sent into Ukraine itself, in a similar fashion to last summer's Afghanistan evacuation, as NATO personnel could get caught up in combat with Russian forces in a highly kinetic scenario, potentially leading to huge escalation. In January, Defense Secretary Ben Wallace confirmed the UK was sending self-defense weapons to Ukraine as tensions with Russia continued to build.